Police say someone deliberately drove over a Newport News woman while she was jogging. It happened Saturday morning on Riverside Drive near Museum Drive. It's a popular park for runners and walkers. She tried to run away, but the car hit her, throwing her into the air. All new at 5, 10 of your side's Liz Palka talked to her on the phone. And Liz, she's so scared she doesn't want to show her face on TV? Yeah, that's exactly right, Nicole. She does not want this man to know who she is. Let me just explain to you where we are. We are right next to Christopher Newport University. Where all of this happened is the Riverside neighborhood. That is right behind CNU. You know, when I spoke to the victim on the phone, she told me the scariest part about this is it was intentional. At least according to her, it was intentional. She was already hyper aware of this man and his car because it had been driving slowly past her a couple different times. Next thing she knew, that car was doing a U turn and was heading straight toward her. Take a look at some of the video from the area. It was 9 30 Saturday morning in the Riverside neighborhood here in Newport News. The woman tells 10 on your side she was running along Riverside Drive. She saw a tan or gold colored sedan, most likely a Toyota or a Honda, driving slowly past her. It was odd enough she kept an eye on him. Once she was on Museum Parkway, which intersects with Riverside, she saw him turn around and pass. Her again a second time. He was staring at her then. Then the man did a U turn, kept eye contact with her, and drove straight toward her, hitting the side of her body, throwing her into the air. I immediately saw my feet fly over my head, and as soon as I hit the ground, I jumped up and was screaming for help and ran as fast as I could. I specifically remember him looking me in my eyes when he hit me, it, and he did not have um, any shock on his face. And she told me she won't forget what he looks like because she is hoping this man will be found. And by the way, the victim told me she is doing okay. She does have a lot of swelling in her knee, uh, bruised around her hip area. Uh, she is walking on crutches right now, but she is going to be okay. And of course, we've checked in with Newport News Police. They are investigating this hit and run. They are asking you if you saw anything suspicious in that area of the Riverside neighborhood, Riverside Drive, Museum Parkway, especially involving a man who appeared to be in his 40s or 50s driving a tan or gold colored sedan if you saw anything suspicious give police a call live in newport news i'm liz palka 10 on your side